jab or job? Let's hear what the panel thinks. I'm going to start with... Shall I risk it and start with Calvin? <laughs> <laughs> so rude. <clears throat> Go on, then. All right. So let's, let's think about these people that we're, we're demanding that they take a medication. Not treatment. demanding. They've been given the dates. They've been told That's the issues. That's a demand. Well, they've given them a deadline. They've given them, given them they a deadline. It's not a demand. Yeah. That's a demand. No, no, it's not so demand. It's people, a deadline. <laughs> it's, it's pedantics. But these people have been caring for our loved ones throughout the pandemic, putting themselves and their lives at risk mm. to care for the people that we love. And how are we rewarding them? By saying, you must do this or else. It's a liberal, first and foremost. But let's look at the numbers as well. We're already facing... So my mum teaches health and social care. She teaches these people. So I'm invested in this a little bit. But we are already 120,000 people short. We don't have enough people to care for our loved ones as it is. Mm. If, if this goes ahead, we're estimating that 70,000 more people will walk out. Can we really have a care profession that is in need of 200,000 people? Depends if they go and get jobs as HGV drivers. But this is... This is also, <laughs> I mean, it's, it's not a laughing matter because... It's, 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 no, it's like, so she said, uh, get a job or get another job. And I think it's disgusting because this is a vocation. These are people that care. They're in this because they want to make a difference and they want to help people. It's not just a job for these people. But also, many people up and down the country can't just pack up and get another job. They can't just retrain. You know, I just spent a, a month up in County Durham in, in, in an area that there aren't any jobs for other people to do. And the, this is something they've invested their time, their training, their effort in. And like the, the good woman just said, um, they wear PPE. They get tested. Some of them already have natural immunity. Some of them will have already have, mm. have had COVID. They might choose not to get the vaccine because it's to, if, essentially it's there to protect you, first and foremost, not other people. Well, no. So that's their personal choice. That's, that's true, but yes, it, does, it, it does help. So it's with their the... personal choice whether they take it or not. And it's very illiberal of us to suggest that they need to get it, otherwise they get the sack.